Good morning. Yes. Welcome to JFK Airport. It's uh, 7 20 in the morning. About to leave for Pebble Beach. We've got JF's big thick folder of stuff right here. This is everything we're going to do. We've got our schedule of events. We've got our maps that Donnie has prepared for us. We've got our Google Maps uh, driving directions, which are useless because I brought a nav, thank God. Uh, we've got our media gate passes. All our good stuff. And we're going to be showing you guys over the next few days the coolest stuff that there is to be uh, seen at Pebble Beach. Especially the Concours, the Black Hawk Exposition, Monterey Historic Races, the Corso Italiano. Some interesting interviews with some people that are much more important than I am. And uh, hopefully some, uh, some really awesome test drives as well. So what you guys are going to want to do is stay tuned to Garage419.com for all this Pebble Beach diggity dankness. But uh, until then, I'm going to order some bacon and eggs because uh, I haven't slept yet and y'all can just uh, be out. Why haven't you upgraded to Vista yet? Just the bad things I've heard about it. Today, I'm going to show you Linda's Mojave. Well, that looked pretty simple. Okay. I'm actually blown away. I'm thinking I'd like to have this. Actually, this is Vista. Really? <laughs> San Francisco Airport, we're going to get our multitude of bags, camera equipments and stuff, and we're going to go pick up our Hyundai Genesis uh, press car to, uh, to go whip around for a little while. Hopefully uh, someone who lives right here can tell us where the good roads are. And, uh, and then we're going to go to check out the setup for Pebble Beach, so uh, stick around. Okay, well they might, they might. You got one of those? How many? Yeah, yes. buddy. Well, give me some more. We got Garage 419 stickers, we're putting them everywhere. Everywhere. Look at this professional packing job right here. Clearly, we are the most professional of automotive media crews. Okay, dear. You're familiar with the death race. The drivers are convicts and the rules are simple. It's kill or be killed. I can see the appeal. Win and get your freedom. Let's play a little offense. <laughs> You're out in front. Who are you going to shoot at? Hold tight. I love this game. You can burn me, you can shoot me, but you can't kill me! Win it all starts August 22nd. Welcome to Monterey, California. We just got down here uh, in our lovely rental expedition. We are uh, picking up our 2009 Hyundai Genesis press car. Uh, it's got a nice black with a uh, little silver flake in it. It's the V6 model, which the uh, representative told us is actually faster to 60 than a Porsche Boxster. Uh, initial impression? actually looks pretty good. For, for a Hyundai, it looks pretty, pretty good. The inside, the leather feels nice. It feels kind of about what I would expect from like an Infiniti. And in fact, the dash layout and the way the, uh, the instrumentation looks uh, is actually very reminiscent of the uh, Infiniti M35. So uh, I think we need to, uh, we need food. So we're gonna go get into Genesis and we're gonna take a ride over to the uh, Fisherman's Wharf and, uh, and get us some seafood. Let's go. Now, as sad as it is to admit, I have never actually used a cooled seat feature. I like the heated seats in the winter. They help. They keep my buns toasty. But I've never tried keeping my buns chilly. Fortunately, the Genesis has the cooled seat. Not on the passenger side, so JF gets screwed on this one. But I would like chilly buns. And as such, I have activated my cooled seat, and I can feel it 
like my ass feels like an air hockey table. It's a nice little, nice little ventilation coming through. I wonder if that uh, helps to spread the fart throughout the cabin. Uh, I guess we'll have to test that theory later after some authentic California Mexican food. But for now, cooled seat and a bottle of Gold Bond, that'll really get you going. You know, <laughs> Hyundai, uh, they did a good job with that car. The exactly. interior feels nice. Well, it's definitely the best car they've ever made. The last Hyundai I drove was like a 98 Elantra that was garbage. And this one is like so much nicer. Parents or something? I think the closest comparison is probably like an Infiniti G35 or maybe an M35. I think it looks a lot like the M35. Minus 20,000. Minus 20,000 bucks, yeah. Um, but it, it, they, it doesn't feel like it's that, like it's cheap. It doesn't feel like it's thrown together. Uh, it's not a sports sedan. I don't know if that's what they're marking it as. It's, it's not, I don't think it's BMW Audi material yet, but it's, you know, it's for uh, a, a, a four passenger people mover that's got some luxury touches to it. I think they did a, they did a pretty good job. Again, there. It'll be a nice car to drive around all weekend, oh, that's yeah, for absolutely. sure. Absolutely. We gotta take that thing over to uh, to Pebble and see uh, see what's going on with that. Sure. Instead of hanging out with these sea lions right here. Let's, uh, let's head over to Concorso, see what's going on over there. Talk to a few people. Look at some cars. Shoddy. They're shoddy. And then, uh, and then tomorrow, I guess we got some, some Pebble Beach action, some, uh, some Laguna Seca, uh, Monterey Historics. And uh, we'll see what we can find. We're going to show you guys a good time. Yeah.